Yo, what's good everyone? It's Roll Easy here. Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we will be talking about the new 100% save method for DM trailer outfits. This is totally legit, nothing fake here. We're gonna get into it right after this message. If you're message. brand new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe and turn on post notifications so you don't miss any of my latest videos. If you're also interested in GTA 5 online modded accounts, go ahead and go to my latest upload and click on this link in the description. This will lead you to the website Digizani. This is the most trusted site to purchase cash and rank services on all platforms for GTA 5 online at reasonable prices. Don't forget once you're done shopping, add the discount code EEZY to save some money at the end of your checkout. Okay, so right back into this video, huge, huge shout out to Boca Boy. I'll leave his link down in the description. Go check out his YouTube channel. He's a good friend of mine. Now, Boca Boy came up or basically found the key element to bringing, you know, transferred outfits from story. Well, technically from DM to story and then to online. Now, the problem with the save is that it's always been very shoddy and uh, we've never really known why. Some people said that they've noticed if they spawn into sessions with events running, it makes the outfit more likely to transfer. So this method, and it's mainly for clean outfits. So that means, you know, outfits that don't have a crap load of layers and stuff. So a lot of the modded outfits that are out right now that are, you know, modded saves are clean outfits. So you can bring those first try, no problem. As for random outfits, we'll see. But this method right here, the key is basically, you see in the bottom right how it says there's an event about to start. It's not that you want to spawn into a session with an event. You actually want to start from a session with an event. So you want to be like any other DM trailer save method. And it works with all the different save methods. But you want to be online with an outfit like this. I recommend sweatpants, like charcoal or crew t-shirt with a parachute bag and a forward cap. And just throw on some canvas shoes and set your spawn location to random. Okay, so just like any other trailer glitch, those are the requirements in the beginning. And you always wanted to go online before you did the glitch. But now, keep finding new session until you see this, an event, you know, about to start. Now, you see this challenge started, so you want a free roam event like this. Now, once the challenge has started, you can go ahead and hold down on the D-pad and you can switch over to your story mode character. Now is when we're about to start the glitch, but you need to make sure, this is the key, that you always start off the glitch by leaving an online session that has a free roam event ready to go. Okay, that's the really important thing. So now once we're back in story mode, we're going to go ahead and enter DM. Now, once upon entering DM, this is what we're going to do. Okay, so what we're going to do is I'm going to go ahead and just show you these modded or modded outfits right here. I could I will leave the save and I will leave a bunch of links down in the description about this glitch. But we're going to just we're going to be doing the save method where you know we just kill the bird and get the wasted sign okay that's the main important one all right so this is the one where if you have shortlisted outfits already made to go the one that some of you guys are going to have to use is how to dupe birds my last video i just posted today i showed how to actually dupe birds manually it takes a while but that is another method to do this if you don't have outfits already saved right here we need to have an outfit with the christmas mask so this save method I'm going to go ahead and do is mainly the PS4 save method, okay? So I'm going to go ahead and get my bird. I'm going to fly out to the ocean, and I want to hover over quit director mode. I'm going to end up double tapping X, and then quickly double tapping the PS button right before I hit the, you know, the water, and start detail online and decline the alert. Now, I was a little screwed up there. I didn't actually get to quit out of director mode before I hit the water. So... At the moment, it's going to go ahead and launch me back into the trailer and I can go ahead and select the bird and I can try to hit it again. So I will successfully hit it on this attempt right here. You just want to make sure you're quick with this. You will get better at this over time, I promise. But for now, you're going to see right here, I will hit it. I'm going to go ahead and open up the interaction menu, hover over quit director mode, and I'm going to double tap X right before I hit the water. You're going to see right here. And here we go. I'm thinking about it a little bit more. I'm waiting for a good wave. I usually go by waves too. They help. So here we go, double tap, PS button, start DT online and decline the alert. I actually missed a bunch of stuff there and it still worked. So I got my wasted sign, I got everything ready to go. So now we're at the point where you're gonna be on this black screen and you wanna go ahead and once the loading circle starts, you can wait a few seconds and then go ahead and do the recent once again. So I'm gonna double tap the PS button, hit start DT online and decline the alert to decline that recent and get it out of there. Okay, so here we go. So I just in line, decline the alert. Now I'm gonna go ahead and enter director mode with the bird. 
and this is where you want to select your shortlisted outfit. So if you if you were duping birds, you've already duped them. You're at this point right now. Okay, so I'm going to be saving a duffel bag with this method. I still needed one more. So this is the duffel bag save right here that Mr. Glitch has put out. Shout out to you. I'm going to go ahead and I want the open green duffel bag. All right, that's the important one to me. The dunce cap I don't really care about, but I just want that open green duffel bag, which is this one right here. So select the DM outfit that you want to go ahead and take online. So as you can see right there, that is the infamous green duffel bag. So I'm going to go ahead and open up the interaction menu and hit quit director mode. All right, so once you hit quit director mode, we will be in story, but you want to go ahead and do this one more time. So enter director mode through the interaction menu and we're going to end up spawning over at the trailer. Now, once we're over at the trailer, we're going to go ahead and enter director mode. And this is the part where I guess you want to be kind of quick with it, but any save method will work. I'll have all the save methods down in the description, so make sure you check them out. But I'm going to go ahead and hit quit director mode and then I will start up that recent activity now. Boca Boy said you can stay in director mode for like 30 seconds or so walking around with the outfit. I don't think you need to, but as you can see, I just sat around in here and walked around for a little while. Nothing too crazy. I'm going to go ahead and quit director mode and quickly start up my recent activity and decline the alert. Now, once I do that, I'm going to decline the alert right here in a second on the recent activity. And then I'm going to press pause really quick. And right now I have an invite for, or I'm going to get an invite from my friend. Okay. So. I'm going to go ahead and get an invite from my friend who is sitting in that job truck off because remember, I'm trying to get the duffel bag. So I'm going to go ahead and just accept that invite into truck off. Uh, my friend has it set to uh, player saved outfits. Um, like I said, all the save methods will be linked down in the description. Remember, we're just doing this just to show you guys that this is a 100% save method. OK, it just if you start off with that free roam event. So right now I'm just waiting for this session to launch. And as you can see right there, I have the outfit right now in the job. I'm going to go ahead and ready up. And so is everybody else. Now, once we're readied up, uh, this this step is a little bit different than normal, only because we're doing this in a job. But pretty much everybody should know what to do right here. It's very similar to the saves we've been doing in the past. OK, so once we finally load into the job, I won't have the duffel bag on me right now, but all I got to do is basically run a few steps, stay in here for a few seconds and then launch creator pretty quickly. OK, so as you can see right here, I like to jump around for a little while. Go ahead and press pause and leave to creator in a bit of a hurry. OK, so it's like not in a hurry at first, but then in a hurry. So once we're up in the clouds, eventually it will load us down into creator. Once we're in creator, you're going to simply just press pause as quick as you can and go over to the online tab, play GT online and hit go. OK, so maybe if you want invite only sessions on Xbox so you don't time out, you could try that. We usually don't have problems like that. So I just hit go just to go into a public session. As long as you started off with the free roam, free roam event, you should be fine. So you're going to see right here, I spawn down and I should have the outfit. Now, for those of you that see, I'm spawning down with no duffel bag right up until I do the little CEO trick. So and funny enough, there's an event about to end in this session as well. So I'm going to go ahead and sign in as a CEO. Head over to the management tab and once you're at management, you're going to go ahead and go to style, go once to the left and once to the right and the duffel bag will reappear and I can go ahead and save the outfit now. So that is the 100% save method. Like I said, there are different save methods. So down in the description, check out how to dupe the birds. I'll have a link to that video because I talked about it shortly. All right, briefly in my last video, but I'll have a link to that one. The duffel bag save method, which I did in this video. Uh, but also in the last one as well. So I have the duffel bag save method, the solo save method for PS4 that was found by Super 420. I'll have a link to that one and a video by True GTA 5, who actually, as you can see right there, the, some messages by him. He actually came up with a little solo, you know, save method that works for him. Very similar to the other ones, but it works for him and it works on Xbox as well. No need for recent activities or anything like that. Now, if you guys want as well, I will have these saves right here with the duffel bags and with all these different modded outfits that Mr. Glitch has made. I'll have links to all of these saves for those of you who want to, you know, use Save Wizard. If you want, I'll leave a link to Save Wizard as well so you can have an easy, you know, route to purchase that if you're interested. But as you can see, there are a lot of benefits to having Save Wizard, especially the ease to get these outfits. This method came out, what, a few hours ago, and I already have all the duffel bags that I need. All right. So as you can see right here, this method is great. I definitely highly recommend it. Big shout out to Boca Boy. That's going to be it for me, though. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and learned something. 
make sure to drop a like on this video and the rest of my videos if you did enjoy my content. If you're brand new, press that big red subscribe button, turn on post notifications, and drop a fat like on this video and the rest of my videos for the freshest and the most informative dope GTA 5 online content. We are on the road to 50,000 subscribers. Peace out.